Now we're getting word of another move here and a report that Kenny Britt is set to sign a four-year contract with the Cleveland Browns in Rappaport of NFL Media tweeting. The Browns are signing Kenny Britt, source said, uh, first reported by uh, Adam Kaplan. Four years, $32.5 million. So the Browns are even involved here. We know coming up they're really going to be busy around the draft with five picks out of the first 65 selections. I'm not sure they're going to keep all of those. I wonder if they're going to uh, move those, trade down maybe, and get more picks. Uh, I personally would like to see that as, as a, not a Browns fan, but I want to see them just bulk up and, and get some more picks and get some more players in there. But uh, Kenny Britt. Yeah, but. See, the, we'll, He's a, he's a nice ad. But right, and they could always solve a lot of their other issues through free agency like they're doing here with Kenny Britt. That's so right. that's a, an addition to their receiving core. It looks like that uh, Miles Garrett, so they can shore up their defensive situation with a big defensive end there. And then with that, uh, I believe it's 12th overall pick. I think it's 12th, I believe. Yeah. The first and 12th. They, he, they could go for a quarterback. So it looks like the pieces I don't want that. are, I are coming that. together. I, would, oh, I, I still wouldn't do that. But they keep talking about how a quarterback is what your franchise is built around. Everyone well, no, in that front every, office. Well, that, no, that's the truth and across that's the, the board. Truth. So, but I'm saying trade that down and get some more picks. You have so many filled. But they also have so there. many picks. They have five out of the first 65. They need more players. You know that. <laughs> they need more players than five to uh, get that team going. I feel so. like those five picks and then additions and free agency, they could have something there. So, uh... Again, it's 4 o'clock Eastern is when these uh, official signings can take place. In the meantime, the reports are coming out. The deals are being brokered. Uh, if you missed it from earlier, we told you that Deshaun Jackson is going down to Tampa Bay. That was a little bit of a shocker because we had heard that uh, he might be in contention for either New England, uh, uh, possibly back to Philadelphia. So he's going down to Tampa Bay. It looks like uh, that's going to be a good deal there with uh, Jameis Winston and Dirk Cutter, who calls the shots there, the head coach who also calls the plays. Uh, Pierre Garçon going out west to San Francisco to be reunited with Kyle Shanahan, the offensive coordinator that he worked with in Washington, now the head coach for the Niners. Brian Hoyer also moving out to San Francisco. Yeah. And uh, Kyle Juszczyk, the fullback. So uh, they're getting all the parts there in place, trying to, trying to rebuild their offensively for the Niners. Yeah, and then we see those marquee names in terms of quarterback, Tony Romo, yeah. Kirk still Cousins, waiting. Nick Foles, still waiting and trying to figure out uh, exactly where they will land.